One photo at Redcliffe. Set at Gloucester Park. This is the cup. Here's John. A quarter of a million dollars. Set. Green light, they're off. Lombo repeater, she got out pretty quick. Cam Bryden drew about a half length on her, trying to be bustled around the outside of the mare. And Big Town Walton is being sent forward as well. Cam Bryden finds the lead. Lombo repeater, Warwick Keen to immediately get off the inside. Prentice knew what was going to happen and he immediately backed off with Big Town Walton and allowed that to occur. Now Cam Bryden's going to let Lombo repeater go to the lead, so there's the first big surprise. Lombo repeater's going to win her way to the top. She moved out two lengths on Cam Bryden, a length and a half have a go, Big Town Walton in the middle, he's still kidding for a trail, Paula's mate's going to oblige, he dashed around three wide, goes to the breeze, on the inside Chivalrous fella, shattering glasses back about midfield in the moving line and then Transit Earl on the inside of another party, highfalutin well back and then the Falcon Strike and Golden Gears is last of all and the four year old, the Falcon Strike is about to take off, they turn into the straight just over two circuits out, they won't want to leave her alone for long, Lombe repeat they thought she'd be the one putting pressure on the leader. Instead, she's the one that's in front. A length away second is Paula's mate on the inside, Cam Bryden. Here's the Falcon strike now to go up and make the race interesting. He'll need to keep some pressure applied. Have a go was next on the inside of Big Town Walton. And then that horse's stable mate, Chivalrous Fella, joined by Shattering Glass. Transit Earl was at the head of the others from another party. And then Golden Gears. And Highfalutin went for a gallop there at the back of the field for no apparent reason. Is down now but lost about four lengths. Lead time at 66.4 is nothing to write home about. Lombo repeater the mare. She's going to take all sorts of beating. She's a length and a half clear. On the outside second, the Falcon Strike. Running third on the back of the leader, Cam Bryden. And then Paula's mate, which covers Have A Go, the reigning pacing cup winner. Further back in the field to Big Town Walton. He's one out and two back, covering Chivalrous Fella. And then the grand old champ, Shattering Glass. On his inside, Transit Earl. The reigning Hunter Cup winner, another party, then Golden Gears, Highfalutin at the bell. In the WA Pacing Cup, 30.3 and 29.7. The half in 60, the one to beat is the one in front. It's Lombo repeater by a little over length on the Fremantle Cup winner. The four-year-old star, the Falcon Strike, can he do it again? Cam Bryden wedding on a run. And then Paul has made his head every chance just behind them. It's been a perfect drive from De Campo. Have a go was next and then Big Town Walton. Further back to Chivalrous Fella, Shattering Class off the bit, then Transit Earl, another party, and well out of it, Golden Gears, Highfalutin, 28-7 that quarter. Inside the 300, Lombo repeater, she's being stared down by the Falcon Strike, who draws level now as they come to the turn. A length away, Paul has made warming to his task, and Big Town Walton is chiming in. Have a go into the clear, is running on. The Falcon Strike went to the lead. Paul has made down the outside. Forever the bridesmaid is... Is he going to break through? Lombo repeater kicking again. Oh, it's a thriller. Lombo repeater, I think maybe. Lombo repeater might have beaten the Falcon strike and Paula's mate. It's a nose by a nose, whatever happens. Big Town Walton's close up fourth, then have a go. Next in was Chivalrous Fella from another party. Transit Earl, Cam Bryden, Golden Gears, Highfalutin, Shattering Glass. Hold on to your tickets. The two best stayers in the race have fought it out. Lombo repeater headed clearly and significantly by the Falcon strike around the turn. She did not look like she could win as they cornered. The danger to the pair of them was Paula's mate. And at the 100 metre mark, I was thinking maybe he's going to finally win one. But right on the line, Lombo repeater kicked again. And her and the Falcon Strike have split it, not a breath between them. Nine gets it. The Falcon Strike makes it the double. The Falcon Strike has won the Fremantle Cup and the WA Pacing Cup, and the run tonight was unbelievable. Lombo Repeater has been beaten by a centimetre, and Paula's mate is a headaway third. And close up fourth, a head away behind those, is Big Town Walton.